Hello, this is your beat update for Monday, March 17th. I'm Morgan Slavin reporting for the newsfeed. New information has been released about Malaysian Airline Flight 370 that disappeared last week. The first communication system, which transmits information about the plane's engines and other airplane parts, continued to send faint hourly pulses recorded by a satellite. The last ping was sent 7 hours and 31 minutes after the plane took off, greatly expanding the territory searchers have to cover. In addition, investigators are now trying to determine whether one or both pilots were involved in the plane's disappearance. Michelle Obama, who has spent years promoting her anti-childhood obesity efforts, spoke at a health summit in Washington on Friday. The First Lady addressed her new focus, which will be to help people cook more of their meals at home. Obama claims that food prepared at home generally has less fat, sodium, cholesterol and calories than meals prepared in restaurants. The First Lady understands that many people don't think they have the time or skills needed to cook for themselves, which is why she will be promoting simple, quick and cheap meals. Snow that is hitting Washington today is bringing up all types of news. 10 inches has already fallen at Dulles International Airport, setting snowfall records and causing delays earlier this morning. While the snow has caused issues for some airlines and some museums in D.C., several attractions still remain open despite the weather. The National Air and Space Museum, National Portrait Gallery, and the Smithsonian American Art Museum all remain open today. And that is your beat update for this Monday, March 17th. I'm Morgan Slavin reporting for the newsfeed. Thanks for watching.